Hello guys, welcome back to another FreeCAD 3D modeling tutorial video. Okay, let's get started. Pick empty file, make sure it is parametric part design and click on create sketch. Pick XY plane, draw a circle at the origin. Make the diameter 30 mil. Click to close. Let's create another sketch. Pick XZ plane. Zoom out a bit so you can draw the path for the piping. Pick polyline and draw the path approximately like this. Add radius using this tool at these corners. Click this tool to add dimensions. I will add equal constraints for both radius. Also the lines. Now the sketch is fully constrained. Click to close. Now switch to model tab and select the first sketch for profile. And the second sketch for the path. Click on additive pipe tool to create the pipe. Click OK to finish. Switch the model from shading to wireframe. Click on sketch, pick XZ plane. Click on model tab and turn on the visibility of this sketch. I will use this sketch for reference. Click on this tool. Click on this center line. Then draw a circle at the middle of this line. Make sure the cursor looks like this. Close the window. Switch back to shaded mode. Click on pad command. Type 100. Turn on symmetric to plane option. Click OK. Check the model. Now select these faces. and click on thickness command. 
into 3 mil for the thickness and remove this option. Click OK. Check the model to make sure everything is good. Click on this face to create a sketch. Click this command to create reference sketch from existing solid. I pick the outside circle. Draw one circle same as this circle. And one more circle for the wall. Add dimension of 3 mil. Close the window. Click on pad command. And enter 30 mil and turn on this option. Make sure all good. Now I'm going to do the same on this port. Okay, now I am going to use the mirror tool for creating the same on the other side. Select the last pad and click on mirrored command. Click here and select reference. Select XZ plane. Click OK. Let's pick up the bottom face to create the sketch. Do the same as before. If you get this message, you have to fix it before moving forward. Let me draw the second circle. Right click to exit. Click and drag the first circle to make sure it is not constrained with the reference circle. Now add tangent constraint to these two circles. Add dimension for the wall thickness. Now the sketch is fully constrained. Close the window. Now you can follow the same steps as before.
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. It will help my channel grow. See you soon.